here we are at the Outdoor Retailer Summer 2016 show here with Hans Flooring. Give me a story. But I thought maybe I'd share with you guys today a story that's not in here um, that I think is just kind of fun and interesting. And it's one of the uh, times me and Yuji, we were going for the record and he'd fly over from Japan and like be totally jet lagged. And we just like drive from San Francisco to Yosemite and be there in the afternoon. And like, well, let's just go for a run on the nose because we know it'll take us maybe four or five hours and we'll be down by dinner time. And um, we did that and like we, we ran into these lovely ladies from Sweden, I think, at the base that we're gonna do the route. And then uh, um, they decided they'd wait till the next day. And we took a day off, came back and like, came in the morning, like at 6 a.m. in the morning, it was freezing cold. And me and Eugene were like, just wearing t-shirts and shorts because we we're like thinking we're gonna go fast. And like, ended up having to wait for some people. And these, these ladies like, gave us their jackets to sit in while we were waiting for folks. And it was this just cool thing because you can't just like, you can't pass people with abandon like your big ego guy, like we're fast, get out of our way, we don't have hall bags, you have to let us pass. You need to ask permission, you know? And um, these, these, these women from Sweden knew that like we kind of got it and we were kind and we weren't just like these crazy obnoxious athletes trying to get past them or other people on the party. And so they were in the same boat as us waiting and like could see that like we're just shivering, shaking and they, they lent us their jackets before we warmed up. So. It's kind of neat. We did a little social media thing like, oh, thanks, Helen and Susie for lending us your jackets. And um, that's kind of the like cool story I like about getting on the nose that, yes, it's popular and you're going to run into people. But if you're kind of like just sharing the route and everybody's kind of happy, like you get these stories of, like, oh, you can borrow my jacket. And, you know, sometimes I haul people's ropes up for them if they're having a tough time on the thing. And I don't know, it's like this long Machu Picchu trail. You meet people along the way, the nose, you meet people along the way. Some people you pass, some people pass you. I Yes, I've been passed a couple times and, um, you know, um, it's just kind of fun that there's so much activity on the route. And in general, people are pretty friendly, you know. You do get your odd folks here and there that are totally stressed out and they're just worked from days. But by then, they're high on the route and you just kind of whiz on by them. For free films and exclusive invites, join our email list at filmfestivalflix.com forward slash email and follow us on social media with Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube. In your home or on the go, we bring the festival to you.